Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host Zila, and we are here today doing the Alpha 9 series in my space hangar. Oh, yeah, I'm upside down. Whoops. <laughs> I'm like, why is this looking like the roof is the floor? Because it, it, it is. Okay, well, well, we're flying upside down over here. We'll just uh, grab some oxygen. The reason why I'm low on oxygen is because I've been working on the CV, the mining CV, a little bit more. So that is the underbelly of it that we're looking at right here. Um, front of it. So I pretty much shaped this thing last episode and got what we see right now done from the outside. Um, the inside, I've laid down a bunch more blocking. You can see all the composite, the carbon... Um, carbon substrate blocks so and then we have our cargo extensions here let me turn some lights on oh. and yeah break my leg no not quite <laughs> the gravity gravity's ferocious at anything above one block i keep forgetting that ah, whatever i wanted to just take a nice leisurely stroll so I didn't have my jetpack blasting away here um, yeah so I gotta fill this in this goes down right through obviously and that's gonna have a door on it uh, and I should be able to pop like a turret in there that can recede uh, out of the way actually all the turrets I'm gonna pop chunks in the hall and put turret i know it's going to compromise the hall but this is not a combat vehicle but uh i don't want the turrets just sticking out i want them to recede when i want them to so <laughs> whatever don't judge me um i'm not sure if i like the core right up there you know what we'll leave it for now I gotta put uh, the extensions, the cargo, the cargo thingamadooies in. So let's let's get our Wi-Fi connected here. So we're gonna go into the base, and that's where our big blocks are. So we're gonna grab more of these carbonate, carbon, blah, 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 blah. carbon composite blocks. Okay. Um, did I make CV? Yep, I made another one. Okay. And ammo, good. And then we have regular. Okay, I gotta use some of these up. Um, although they're very expensive to in power, so eh, but that's okay. Okay, this is good for now. We'll just we'll use this. So what I want to do is I kind of want to finish off the cargo. A bit here we've got six of the larger cargo well five right now I'm gonna put another one there um, and that'll help block off unfortunately what I should do is if I put if I put something on an angle here it could block it up I just I just don't want to put uh, it'll have tons of room for my vehicles. That's fine. <laughs> it's actually quite a nice size hangar for a mining vehicle. Okay. Um, so this leads up to the cockpit level. I'll finish filling this in with extensions. So that's going to be all full of extensions. These are the same runs. So this is one cargo box. How big is it going to be now? i got to... Uh, if I put an extension on right now, so I could knock out the wall. I was thinking of like knocking out this wall piece here. So let's do that. I think that's cool. Let's do that. And then we have the extension. Um, yeah, that one there. So that one's on four. 
And so do we want it facing this direction or the other direction? This direction into here is the is gonna be the construction um upstairs. Well way upstairs. I'll show you upstairs. There's a there's like a this is just a mezzanine right here. The cockpit is on a mezzanine level. And I'm gonna have like um like some uh railings along there i guess i think yeah then we'll have i don't know something maybe some glass i don't know but anyway in the meantime let's get these cargo set up so this should we have it facing in this direction i have cargo facing into the i have it facing that direction or do we have it this direction. Let's do this direction. So let's knock this one out too. And then hmm do I want to do another yeah I think I do. I think I just want to do another one Oops. Ugh. Right. <laughs> okay, yeah. Uh, twitchiness. Look look what I'm doing before I push the button. Okay, so let's go there. So that gives us two containers that are right now two hundred and sixty four thousand, so not maxed out. We can leverage more of the wall there. I guess we can come in behind and along the wall we can come up because I need something for the ammo and the I want to do um, I want to do the ceiling for the ore and then ammo oh, I could do ammo on the other side so ammo there One on each side. Um, it would have to be on top because it has to be separated because it won't. They don't stack. Ammo and then cargo on the other. I mean, I got the two big cargo, regular cargo, and then ammo and ore and wood. But the ore and wood. The ore and wood I want to do up into the ceiling. So, you know what? I think the ore and wood, we're going to go there. No, maybe not. We're going to go here. What's that? What's that right there? Steel block. Oh, that's, yeah, I don't want that anymore. I don't want that steel block anymore. Steel blocks, yeah, we want to get rid of those. I'm not using those anymore. Okay, um, so if I put the cargo one in here, I extend it out into the floor there for the, well, this is, a lot of this is going to be broken away, so it's just kind of going to be on the outskirts of the I should be able to fit a decent sized garden in here, I think. I should be able to fit a bunch of grow plots. Looks like one, two, th one, two. Oh, I see. Hmm. I could do three up the middle and do a bunch, I guess. I don't know. We'll try and get a bunch of grow plots up here anyway. So, I want to do the ore one up here. Let's. Which one was the ore one again? Which one was my ore one? Number two. Okay. So let's have it facing that way. Might as well. Who cares? And then ammo. Hmm. I know, if I pop this out, if 
I pop that out, put the ammo there. That's this one. And then, see now, we're all separated by the stuff, the plastic. And yeah, let's knock that out. Um, and then we just put uh, that back in. So let's grab that there. Uh, okay. Good, good. We're going to have to get a bunch of thrusters in pretty quick here too. So let's do that. So let's finish this wall off here. We'll get that. So we got some separation there. We can pop. How much blocks do we have here available? Oh, nothing in here. Did I, did I run out? Crap. Have I run out? Oh, we got 20. Okay, that's not going to be enough. Okay, let's get some more made here. Just poke our head out here so we can see the constructor. Get into here. And we'll put the blocks, that's fine. I don't have, okay, I got carbon composite. Uh, oh, what's this? Ore and wood, another ore and wood. Hmm. Okay, well, let's get some more extensions built. I need at least uh, let's go for 20 more and then that should be just a butt load of cargo that this thing can do so I don't think I necessarily need to go with two of the ore and two of the ammo especially not two of the ammo Okay, so extensions, let's get some of these extensions thrown in. So for starters, let's knock out some of these. And now I was gonna... I wanna go both directions with this to try and keep it as balanced as possible. So, and then from side to side, come on, side to side. And then we can run up the sides. Is that going to be too much? I don't want to do too much because that's just a waste. Uh, I think we can do some more here. So if we're going to bring that forward more on each side. Because this I want to max right the hell out. I want a 320. Well, let's start by just removing all these on the on the edges here. always add the blocks back in that's not a big deal okay and let's just get these in so what is that so far that is 64 so we need a lot more so let's go like that in like this and we can't see it anymore to actually <laughs> we got to go down through here to see what uh, here let's let's level off we'll break out the drone it's easier to navigate the 
around when um, out in space, really. When you're trying to navigate all these elevators and crap, it can be a little bit tedious. Okay, let's actually get some extensions in for the ammo. Okay, that should probably even be enough for the ammo. Let's see. Let's see. Got to do it this way. Uh, 24,000. I'm only putting like 30 mil in. I'm only putting 30 mil in. So, I'm not sure how heavy 30 mil is. It might be really heavy. I'd have to go look. I guess we got to build a door for here. I guess it doesn't really matter, although it's a good idea. Okay, um, I guess we can finish these off here too. Well, with that batch, let's get some more. Uh, we've also got our growing plots that we can throw, throw in upstairs. Those are concrete, they won't work. Okay, so are we gonna need more than that? We might, we might, because we've got all these floor ones we gotta do, right? So. Okay, that finishes off these ones, which give them 296,000. So just shy of a maxed out container. So I could I could pop You know what? Let's let's do that. We might as well. We might as well pop those two. And I can even creep this up the wall a bit, I guess, to max max these out too. It's not a bad idea. Let's do that. Okay. So, well, I don't want to get out too far, though. I don't really want to go past the second block and get too far off center because I think that could make it more problematic in atmosphere with, with heavy loads off center. Um, so, I'm just going to pop this one out. Just add the one there and do that here. Yeah. Sweet. Okay, this ship's going to be cool. This is going to be a total Alpha 9 out. Alpha Ninerd. It's an Alpha Niner. Okay, uh, right, we were going to look to see, and that's on the other side. That's the other side. So, oh, I guess I could have just went in that way. <laughs> derp a derp, Wi-Fi in. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't. Well, I guess I don't need to come all the way down here with my drone when I can just... <laughs> Ah, I'm an idiot. I love it. Okay, uh, 136,000. Not even close yet. That's not even half. Okay. Damn. This thing's going to consume some fuel because of all this crap, too. It's not going to be the cheapest vessel to run, I don't think, unfortunately. So it's not really going to be viable as even a a starter CV. It's. I mean, this is, this is a really niche, purpose-built sort of. Pretty much end game. I mean, it's you know level twenty-five, so, and you're gonna need some, a decent amount of gear, mats to build it in the first place. So yeah, you're probably gonna have a CV already just to be able to build this CV. Whatever. I don't care. I'm building it anyway. Damn it. Okay, uh, where the hell? Okay, how much was that again? That was Capital Vessel, Ormwood, 152,000. 152,000. So let's grab these, go to there. We'll drag that across to the same. It's not going to be enough. I'm just 
trying to, I don't want to overshoot my two Oops. Freaking ran out. Oh my freaking God. Okay, well, I'm going to have to make more. What are we at? Uh, 216. Okay. So we got a bunch more to make then. So let's do that. Let's get out of here and get some oxygen. Because, you know. Hey, wait, why is the oxygen off in here? Wait, it's not. It's because that's my drone. <laughs> let's, uh, let's go. Huh? Wait, why is the oxygen on in here now? <sighs> oxygen off and oxygen on. Wow. Okay, I guess I could have just sat here. I shouldn't have any oxygen, but that's fine. No, I guess I should. I should have it because it's not technically sealed yet. Whatever. That's what this is here for. Top-ups while construction on things without air. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's head back in. So we've got this strip up here feeding it all the way along. I'm not sure if that's going to be enough. We could we could run two runners to either side along here too. That's not a bad idea. Or we can let's finish off the inside here. Let's get some more built. Where are we here? Get this and right here, and that is SV, so let's get, um, well, let's make another 20. Not really sure if I want to keep the core there, and, but I don't know. Is it really going to get shot out from the back? Maybe. I'm going to have... Um, I'm going to have some logistics in place so that that door is only going to be closed unless something is like right in it. Then it's going to be open type thing. So, or down on the, if, if something is like non-enemy is something like here, the ramp will come out, the door will open. Other than that, when it's not activated, the ramp will pull up and the door will close. So we'll get that going too. But for now, we got to get everything else in here. So, is it ready? Is it secret? Is it safe? Okay, come on. Space hangar blocks. Where are you? Oh, one left. One left to go. Bring it. Bring me my space hangar block. No? 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 Fine. <clears throat> okay. Um, do it across to either side. It's not a bad idea. I think I, I, I think I want to do that. And that'll probably finish off the... The cargo portion. Oh, wait, I know. I got to do the... I got to finish off upstairs, don't I? Yeah, because I didn't finish off evenly upstairs. Right here. So we're one in, and we're too shy. So we need to get these in first. Um... runs to the side. You know what? Maybe I should just run this all the way down to the front then. Just run this all the way down. Let's do that. Let's do that and then we'll see where we're at. Okay. Capital vessel. We want the 
Orin Wood and 296. Getting there. Getting real close now. Okay, good. So let's let's go back down here and so yeah, we we'll, we can go like this. And then the other side. What's that at now? 320. Okay, so we let's hmm. Let's not balance. So let's um. Did I put too much in? Let's see. Three twelve. No. Okay. Um. Hmm. That's unfortunate. That's not balanced. Looking. <laughs> it's all about the looks. Damn it. Well, I could. Uh, I guess one off isn't going to be too bad. Let's let's pop it in here. We'll we'll put it back in here. Um, where'd you go? We are on the wrong thing because I think I'm still. Oh no, I'm connected to base. That's what I'm connected to. So it went back into here. There you are. And oh, I guess I could have just grabbed from the stack that I already had. And we'll just um, do a carbon composite there. Okay, so what do, what's the bottom ones at now? Let's take a look. So we've got controller at 304,000 and controller 1 at 304,000. So... Where can we, uh, we can, we can, we can get it to 312 by popping that block. I can't put anything in that one because the ammo controller is using it. So, but I can pop one there on either side. So let's do that. I'm trying to maximize the cargo without going too far off center. This is going to be ridiculous on fuel. Whew. I'm really scared when I fire this thing up if I can even afford it. But yeah, I'm joking. I know I got stacks of promethium. <laughs> and, st and like and like a whole giant container full of water. So yeah, I can I can I can do it. I can pull it off. <laughs> Okay, plus we really haven't went and explored the universe yet anyway, so hopefully this thing is what is going to bring us the universe. That's what I'm looking forward to, mining out the universe. We need it in some comfort, I think, so I'm making this appropriate size to do that. What are these at now? That is 312, like I said. Okay, so we're only one block shy on each of those. We can uh, do it right here. Or right there. It don't matter. We can do it right there. Perfect. Okay, I think they're all maxed out now. 320. 320. And 320. I'm not maxing out the ammo because this thing is... I think that's going to be enough. I'm pretty sure that's going to be enough. At least I hope it is. If not, I can reconfigure some of this stuff to and add more ammo. So, not a big deal. Not a big deal. Uh, okay, well, that's our cargo situation. I think we're squared away for cargo. That's, we're done. We're done the cargo. So I'm kind of, I'm liking that. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. So we've got, we've got six of the 16,000 SU standard cargo boxes, the 64 slot 
standard cargo box. And then we have two maxed out container controllers and a maxed out ore and wood. So what if you if you max out the ore and wood, you transfer it the prop whatever it is into the appropriate container controller. So um yeah, this thing has some serious freaking storage. Serious, serious freaking storage. Like we can almost take everything we have with us in this thing. <laughs> type type freaking storage. Okay, uh, let's go upstairs. And this is where the engine compartment and the um, other crap is going to be. So we got to put the warp drive up here. And I want that to be fairly close to center. So I'm going to lay it across on its side. That means I want to put some other stuff up here too. The, the problem is... Um, I also want to put stuff along here. This is this is actually going to get all buried by, um, because well, it's just going to be buried. Uh, so I don't need any more of the cargo extensions. Okay, so how are we going to do this? That is not going to function. That is not going to function. We need two, so it's going to be one, two, three, four, five. We only have five wide to deal with. So if we do three, we start there one, two, three, and then one, two, three, one, two, three. one out so one two oh, it jumped one two three I can have this one just missing its thing in the center I guess one two three one two three yeah let's see that I'll have one of them I'll have one of them that has no uh <laughs> you come up right in the middle of the garden literally that's not so bad that would actually be kind of cool okay so let's do that let's lay these out um, so what I'm thinking is Stop being jittery. And then another nine here and on the other end. I'm really hoping how I design my cargo extensions that they evenly distribute distribute the weight for the most part, uh, except for the, there's going to be a tilt side to side for the regular cargo ones, but the ore and wood should just straight up the center and feel like it's dead metal all the time, I think. I think, I think, I don't know. We'll see. Will it even matter? I guess we'll see about that too. Uh, ran out. Okay, so did I actually have more? Mm, does not look like it. Right, we can put another one of these in. Right there. I don't think I'm going to bother continuing right up through. Even though... Uh, 
Even though it'd be kind of cool. Let's, yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. We'll go right up through and have uh, um, one continuous elevator shaft that, that punctures the entire craft. Okay. Nope, 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 nope. Come on. That one. There we go. And we're getting there. We're getting there. So it's kind of going to be a weird garden with an elevator shaft right up the middle. <laughs> okay, I need five more grow plots. And then, oh no, I need, uh, what the hell am I talking about? I need eight more. Eight more and then that'll finish off the grow plots. We can, we can fill in the rest with just composite. Although I do want to put in some some heavier, although do I want to put it away on the edges? Maybe some of the more, I don't know, heavier engine, it's like the uh, fuel and all that, because they're just ridiculous. Let's see, that's um, 159 tons. Holy crap. So that's 159 ton per. Whoa. 75. So that's only 150 if I so it's lighter if you use two two of those. But that's 6,000, that is 2,700. So 5,400 as opposed to 6,000. That's where the trade off is. Okay. Got that to put in. Uh, I don't think we're going to get all this in. <laughs> I don't think we need to, though. Um, so the Jennies. How big are they? 40 tons. What? That doesn't make any sense. I mean, these are all, well, no, I guess they're not as big. So these are four squares. These are three squares as opposed to four squares. So but these are technically like double the, more than double the weight per square than a generator. Huh. Okay. That's incredibly heavy. It's freaking weird. 24 tons. So the, the fuel tank, the freaking fuel tank is like six, seven times the weight of a medium thruster. No, that's got to be wrong. 159 tons. 24 tons. Okay, they need to rethink that. <laughs> Is that full? I guess that's what they're signifying. That's why that's at full capacity, maybe. Okay. Anyway, let's stop doing the math. Um, I think I'm going to call it here. There's, I'm, I'm not sure. Here, we, actually, you know what? We do have time for a little bit more thruster fun so let's do that let's get some thrusters going here we don't need these anymore I'll actually grab these because we'll need those and so we need to get some some side out the side thrusters going now should we do it from the top right from the very top and go like kind of mimic what these ones are here or should we do the side and then because that when that gets filled in two three hmm. that's going to burn us potentially if we leave big 
Hmm. Besides, let's, or we do go below. Oh. Hey. There we go. Would that work? Because we just put in a, oh no, that'll cook our, that's going to be a hot spot below if I do that. So I don't necessarily want to do that. I don't want to I don't really want to do that at all um, well, if we just bunch it all up right here <laughs> uh, darn freaking hot spots you know what let's just let's do this let's do this one let's do these I'll just have it a little bit more back. One back. Whoa. Okay. Uh, here, let's get a, let's get a symmetry plane while I place these things. Nope. Yep. Okay. And we'll just go outside to do this. Before we suffocate. And see, now we're off center. But if we... You know what? I think we're going to splurge and do 10 for each side. So I'll, ma I'll make two more. I know it's gonna start getting real heavy, but I think the side to side movement is gonna be kind of important. Okay, let's get these in. Oops, that's not it. And we want that. And then we want to go like this and spin it. And put that in there. Boom. Boom. And come on. Boom. I really wish they'd give you more than six in a stack. Give me a dozen, at least, please. Oops. There we go. And there. Come on. And there. Okay, so that's the side to side, but that's only five each side. Right, I need to double up on that. So if I do the ones in the center, should I do ones on the bottom? No, I'm already cooking, cooking stuff out there. Huh, what if I... What if I do these ones, and then instead of instead of ten, they get nine each side. Let's do that. Ah, <laughs> oh, right. What the heck was I doing? I can't do that. That's just stupidness. Okay, so let's put that back. <laughs> derp a derp. Yeah, let's just nuke our other thruster. Stop jittering right there. Okay, so... Hmm. I guess I just got a line. I, I can do them on the bottom. I can. Well, not 
that really. If I went there, no, even that, it's not going to work. Um, yeah, I just got to continue on here. So I can do it here. I could skip, so we've got what, five. If I do another two, that's seven. And that's almost eight. <laughs> uh, I could maybe get two more in. Let's see. So if I do, stop jittering. Do that one. And then, oh, that, this might actually work. That. I might get nine here. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Oops, that wasn't what I wanted. Come on. It's that one. And... Nope. Get back down there. And get you in. All nice and tidy, snug as a bug, and whoa, and come on, and last, but not least, oh crap, it's not going in the other side, is it, because I never popped out the other side, I never popped out the other side, actually that's kind of cool, that's kind of cool. That's a target. I don't care. Um, yeah, I didn't pop it out. Okay, so let's get these popped out. Oh wait, that's that's wrong. What the hell am I doing? I'm like, wait, that doesn't line up. <laughs> No kidding, it doesn't line up because I'm zapping the wrong frickin' block. You frickin' moron. Okay. <sighs> I need to get some blocks back then. That back and stop the jittering. Thank you. We'll pop those out. Okay. And oh, we're getting low here. Okay. So let's flip that. So we need two more. It's not, oops, it's not a big deal. Put that one there. Got a single. That could be a pain in the ass. Okay. Get this in. Nice. So we have up, down, forward, left, right. We have no front. We have no front. Interesting. Interesting. Where am I going to do the front? See, I, I think, can I get away with putting one in here? Let's see. We 
maybe, yeah, I think I could. So let's do that. And then... I can't do one there, but I could probably do one under it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then another one here. Okay, that looks doable. It's getting a little jumpy. That's that's a sign that the episode is pretty much at its end. <laughs> okay, let's get the last six here in. Oops. Come on. There, that's what I want. And then we want this and like this. And we want that. So right there. And there. And there. I'll need to put more thrust in on the front, but right now it's actually probably flyable if I put uh, a generator and a fuel tank in it right now and some RCS. Oh yeah, RCS. Well, I think we're done this episode for now. The... Um, The ship is really coming along now. And I'll be popping in. Uh, oh, yeah, that's the other thing. I got to do that. I should do that right now. Oh, is that going to fit? Because, yeah, it will, because I've got that on the other. Yay! Yay! It's all going to work. So, what I want to do is go like this. Jeez, stop it there. And then I've got these made. So I wonder what happened if it puts both in facing the correct direction. Let's let's get these blocks zapped out. Oh I think can I place more than Yeah, they're stacked, so it should allow me to place more than one. Okay. That's right. That's right. Right all the way to the front. Okay. I was just like, did I not do that? Oh, a second measure. Measure twice, cut once, right? Okay. So now, let's see what this is going to be like. We want the cannon turret. Yeah, I want the cannon turrets. They got better range. They don't do as much damage. 700. These are 350, but they these fire three times as much. Even though that these are like double damage. So, yeah, they're they're about 50% more damage overall over a minute than the cannon turret, but the cannon turrets have better range and can track faster. So, uh, I don't know. I, I like the cannon turrets now. They seem the range significance seems to be a factor, so I like it. And let's just go with the retractable cannon turrets. 
Now, did it place two of them down? It looks like it did. Yep. Facing the proper direction. Nice. And then I want another one. I'll do the other one up top right now. Because that's pretty cool. That'll fit right there. Oops. Yeah, I know. It's if the turret blows up, then everything dies. Well, if a if a block blows up, period, on this thing, everything dies. So it just doesn't matter. Is a turret more likely to be shot at? Yeah, but I don't plan on being shot at. So okay, retractable cannon and right like that. Sweet. Okay. That gives us some guns off the front now. It's like a guppy with three eyes. I don't know. <laughs> uh, once we put the drills on, this is there's this is going to look different. Trust me, it's going to look completely different, but uh, it's getting there. We're getting there. We got uh, we got thrust in every direction. Not enough off the front yet, but that uh, we can add a couple more in, and I think it should be sufficient. We've got a good amount off the sides. Um, I mean, nine should be good. Nine should be good, and. Yeah, if we put a couple more off the front here, eight should be okay off the front, I think. I don't know where I'm going to put them yet. Maybe up, maybe one up there and one below. That's probably not a bad idea. Okay, guys, well, I'm going to call it here. Uh, we're getting lots of progress done on the CV. Won't be long before we're taking this out. So this thing's looking good now. We've got pretty much most of the engines in. Uh, we just got to throw in the generators, some of the equipment really now. That's what's going in. We got to put the gear in. So I'm thinking um, I will texture and paint it and start getting this finished off, getting some more gear and getting the walls done. Uh, stuff like that, and then um, next next uh, well next episode if I don't die apparently because you know I'm gonna starve to death, <laughs> you know. And oh, actually I'm gonna suffocate. So that's 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 something. <laughs> uh, get back out in the atmosphere here, or the oxygen, I should say. Okay, guys. Well. I'm going to leave the episode here. Um, next episode, we will continue on. I know this is a long, slow, boring process, but I'm kind of a long, slow, boring person. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Uh, yeah. That's coming along. It's coming along. It's taking good shape. I think it should... Uh, it should actually serve us quite well, I think. So, yeah, we'll get the gear in it. We'll get it painted up, and uh, we'll get it ready to go here. So, almost. We're almost ready. Till then, guys, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day. <laughs>